welcome to Cooking with Craig. Today we're going to be making a slow cooked chicken, soy and tomato based slow cook. So what we've got here is our uh, insert to our slow cooker. Our slow cooker is behind me on the bench. Getting all nice and warmed up, ready to go. So let's put this aside so that it's ready to go. So we're going to put it in, in there, ready to go. So while that's heating up, we need to prepare our potatoes, carrots, onions, all ready to go in the cock pot. We also have our boned chicken. Now you can use drumsticks, thighs, these ones I'm using here are chicken wings. So just be aware of uh, what type of chicken you can use for a slow cooker. I also have garlic, soy sauce, and a tomato based pasta sauce. These are all ingredients that you'll need to, uh, to make the sauce. Now, I also have some brown sugar because we're gonna it give it a nice caramel taste. The soy sauce gives the, the, uh, the salty taste to it and everybody loves garlic. So, what we need to do here is we need to peel our carrots, our potatoes and our onions. The onions go in whole, the potatoes get diced into little pieces and our carrots get uh, about two centimetre uh, chunks and put in. So, let's get started. So, now we need to get our wet ingredients ready to go in. Six to 700 grams of tomato-based pasta sauce, uh, a quarter of a cup of brown sugar, half a cup of soy sauce, and two teaspoons of minced garlic, all mixed into a bowl ready to be put over our other ingredients we're gonna be putting into the crock pot in a minute. So, let's get this all ready to go. Now we just stir the mix together. Like so. And we set this aside to go with our uh, chicken and vegetables in a minute. So what we've got here, we've got our carrots, our onions and our potatoes. We don't need all of these uh, <laughs> potatoes because uh, that would be way, way too much. So we just need... Uh, just a couple. And they're nice and small. So, we just need about, about that much in volume. So what we need to do here, is we need to quarter these. We need to peel these and we need to peel these and ch cut them into about two centimeters, so probably about half or thirds, depending on the, on the length of the carrots. So let's uh, chop these up and put them in the bowl. Now, as you can see, all of our vegetables are ready to go into our mix. So what we'll do now is we'll bring our warmed up crock pot over to the middle bench and put all our ingredients together. Okay, so we've got all of our vegetables ready. We've got our sauce ready. We just now need to put them all together in the crock pot, which has been sitting on the, uh, in its, in its uh, heater, ready to go. Cause it is, it's warm, warm to touch, just not boiling hot as yet. So it was warming up nicely for us. So let's put our chicken in now it's a kilo of chicken wings put our onions in and around the bottom what we're doing is just making sure everything gets a nice little location so carrots and then the potatoes over the top so 
everything is in there nicely. You don't want it all the way out to the top of the brim because uh, I've had in the past when I've cooked with cock pots, they bubble up and bubble all over the sides and you don't want that kind of a mess. So now we add our tomato based mix, which has our soy sauce, our garlic, and our brown sugar in it. Goodness in there. Just going to rinse this out with a little bit of water to get all of that uh, goodness down in there. go and there we go all ready all I have to do now is put the lid back on this and whack it onto the uh, the cooker so let's get down and do that so we just bring this over now and we put it in now the crock pot is set to low and now put the lid on and we'll leave it for eight hours. Sitting in the back of the corner of the kitchen, cooking away. Great for winter time. Um, you can set it before you go to work uh, or you know, on a weekend when you know you're gonna be out all day and then you're gonna come home and you'll have your dinner already cooked, ready for you. So, let's let this time lapse. So our slow cooker has about 30 minutes left on its uh, cooking. So what we need to do is we need to prepare what we're going to be serving with it. We're going to be serving rice. So I'm going to get uh, the, our rice cooker up and running and uh, whack that on the bench. So it should come out about the same time as our slow cooker does. Rice takes about 30 minutes. So let's get down to that. One cup of rice. Now on the inside of this, it has cups. So we always fill it up to about four. That's done. Plug it in, set it to cook, and she's done. So, now we just have to wait 30 minutes. See you guys soon. So, all that's left now, slow cookers finished cooking, rice is finished cooking, our scones are perfectly cooked. All we have to do now is dish up. Let's get on to that. So, this concludes our Cooking with Craig episode where we have made slow cooked chicken wings. Make sure you also check out the link below for our scones that we've also served with our chicken wings today. If you've seen anything in these videos you do like, make sure you give me a big thumbs up. If you have any comments, questions, or things that I can be doing better in these videos, leave it in the comments field below on YouTube. And if you haven't yet hit that subscribe button, hit that subscribe button. So you get notified when I do these, Cooking with Craig episodes, my daily vlogs, 
car maintenance, unboxings, you name it, I film it, it ends up on YouTube. So make sure you hit that subscribe button. And until next time, I'll see you in the next video.